Hi, I'm Krisa May Diga Bukan, and this video is from Group 8. Of all the water in the world, only 2% of it is fresh water. 70% of the fresh water is frozen, while the 30% lies underground. And it is leaving less than 1% for human consumption. Because of this, billions of people around the world are continuing to suffer from poor access to water. Yet, our group had thought of an idea of some 20 ways on how to save and conserve water. You must check your toilets for leaks. Toilets leak more than any other water using item at home. They can be costly. Save water and money by checking your toilets for leaks. We should take shorter showers. A shorter shower not only saves water, but also saves on the energy used to heat that water. Stop using your toilet as a waste basket. Flushing anything but human waste and toilet paper can cause big problems for your plumbing, our sewer system, and the environment. Turn off faucet while brushing your teeth. Conserving water helps conserve energy and reduce carbon pollution. Just by turning off the tap while brushing your teeth in the morning and before bedtime, you can save up to 8 gallons of water. Use your automatic washing machine only for full loads. It's worth waiting until you have a full load of clothes that needs washing. If you don't fill up the machine, then you're just wasting electricity and water. Keep a bottle of drinking water in the refrigerator. Many people waste water by letting the tap run cold before filling up their glass. You can save water by filling a jug or bottle with the tap water and keeping this in the fridge. By doing this, you can enjoy ice-cold water without wasting a drop. If you wash dishes by hand, do not leave the water running for rinsing. When you do wash dishes by hand, Try using a little water to get your sponge soapy and wet, then turning off the faucet until you're ready to rinse a bunch of dishes at once. You should check faucets and pipes for leaks. A small drip from a worn faucet washer can waste 20 gallons of water per day. Use a broom to clean dry waste sidewalks and steps instead of water. Washing your sidewalk or driveway with a hose can use 200 or more liters of water. If you use pressure washer, you are also using electricity and creating noise. Don't run the hose while washing your car. This is one of the most important way to conserve water because right now we are experiencing the water interruption because of water shortage. We know that water is very important to us in our body and to our needs as a human. In this way, by avoiding wasting of water, we can conserve it and we can help into our environment. We should also save and catch rainwater. Harvesting rainwater not only saves the environment by greatly reducing dependence on treated water from the mains, it also helps us to reduce our water bill. Don't forget to check running faucets before you go to sleep. In this simple way, we can help conserve water and avoid flooding the house. 
Look for leaks regularly. Even a small leak can waste several gallons of water a day and can add up on your bill. Water your plants early in the morning as possible. The very best time to water plants is in the early morning while it is still cool. This will allow the water to run down to the soil and reach the roots of the plant without too much excess water lost to evaporation. Consider using a rain barrel to cut rainwater to help nourish your outdoor plants. When you get rain barrel, you can collect runoff during storms and rain, which you can use on your lawn and garden, dramatically reducing the amount of water you use from your home water line during the summer months and beyond. Don't keep the faucet running while washing clothes. Leaving water running can waste around 20 to 40 liters of water. Close the taps or faucets properly. This is also important because every drop counts. Use less electricity. In most cases, electricity or gas is used to heat water. So the less hot water to use, the less energy needed. Reuse wastewater to clean your floors. Wastewater can be used similar as rainwater or gray water for purposes such as gardening and urban farming, toilet flushing, and etc. Water your garden with a watering can. This helps to reduce evaporation. Save water, save lives.